This is the most powerful metal I have ever seen in my life. I have seen conversions. I have seen physical healings. I have seen people return from wayward, sinful lives to having the desire to become a great saint just by wearing this medal. I have seen lives changed, personally. Just the other day, I was with my mom, we were waiting in line, and I struck up a conversation with the woman behind me in line. It came up that she was a fallen away Catholic. I pulled a miraculous medal out from my pocket and handed it to her. She held the medal with such affection and love, and she was looking at the image of Our Lady, and she was just gripping it, and she started to cry and she recommitted to returning to Mass, and she realized that this was the sign that God was sending her, that it was time to come back, because there was another woman there. I thought, well, I can't not give this woman a miraculous medal too. So I brought one to her as well. She held it with the same just immediate reverence, like she was struck by a lightning bolt when I handed her this medal. And she just started crying. And she put it on right then and there, and she goes, I'm never gonna take this off for the rest of my life. Great saints like Mother Teresa, she spent her whole life handing out miraculous medals. Just like Jesus, lepers from all directions would flock and lines and lines of people would come to her. And every person who came to her, she gave the miraculous medal to. Last night, I had dinner with someone who was telling me about their cousin who, when she was two years old, had an enormous tumor in her stomach. Her mother brought her to Mother Teresa and Mother Teresa said, show me where it hurts. She took the miraculous medal, she pressed it to her stomach, prayed with her, and then gave her that miraculous medal. She went in for surgery the next week. She was completely cancer-free. There was no tumor to be found, not a trace of it. She still wears the miraculous medal to this day because she's still alive some 30 years later. Why is it so powerful? Because the Virgin Mary is so powerful and she works through humble instruments, and she has her arms open, distributing the merits and the grace of her son to all who come to her, and wears her medal, calls upon her name, looks upon her image with affection. She will protect. I'm wearing my miraculous medal underneath my habit. I'm not allowed to wear any external jewelry. You'll notice that in the original image of the Miraculous Medal, when Our Lady appeared to St. Catherine Labore, rays of light were coming forth from her hands. There were gaps in the rays, and St. Catherine asked, Blessed Mother, why are there gaps in the rays of light coming from you? And Our Lady said, those are the graces that no one will ask for. Our Lady told St. Catherine that she promised great graces for anyone who wore the Miraculous Medal and especially anyone who wore it around their neck. It is a sign of our consecration to the Virgin Mary. It's a sign of our love. But also, as Maximilian Kolbe says, it's the safeguard to our consecration. It's what protects us in our desire to remain faithful to her. So wearing it as an outward sign on your chest is a sign to the world that I belong to the Immaculata. I belong to the Immaculate Virgin Mary. I am hers, and she is mine. And the miracles and the power that you will witness, just by your witness of wearing this medal, I don't have words to describe it except just do it and see. We want the salvation of souls. We want to bring our family, our friends, the world, back to the love of Jesus Christ. And Our Lady is saying, I want that more, and I will do it, but you must ask me to do it. Jesus said, ask the Father to send laborers. The harvest is ripe. Our Lady is saying the same thing, ask me to save souls. Ask me to convert the world, and I will use you to convert the world. I will use this image, this medal, to bring your family back to the church, to bring your friends back into the fold, and to convert your own heart. I have never known anyone who has worn this medal with affection or devotion who has not grown 
in their spiritual life. I have never seen that happen because there is certain grace and power that Our Lady gives through this medal that is just guaranteed by our mere act of wearing it with, with some fervor and devotion. She gives grace. As St. Maximilian Kolbe said, the miraculous medal will be the best means for attaining these gifts. And so he says it's a first-rate weapon, and he calls it the silver bullet, with which a faithful soldier hits the enemy that is evil and thus rescues souls. He says, wear the miraculous medal because the Immaculata has promised her protection to anyone who does so. What are we supposed to do with this? Buy the miraculous medal. Purchase them in great quantities. Keep them in your home, in your office, in your drawer. Never leave the house without having at least a couple in your pocket. And wear it on your person so that the moment that Our Lady brings that soul to you that she is ready and desiring to save, you will be ready. Thank you for watching this video. In the description will be links to purchasing miraculous medals in bulk, as well as other items that will be helpful for you in your mission of evangelization. May God bless you and Our Lady keep you.